everyone. Welcome back. Uh, my name is Candice Chang. I'm here with Herman Stern. Uh, you may have seen me on a few other videos. I've been telling you the, uh, about the stock decisions that I made. Today, I'm asking Herman for his recommendations. <laughs> okay. Yeah, my recommendations. Um, this summer, uh, I bought a stock that I wanted to buy for a long time. Uh, it's called uh, Holzim, the cement company. And I didn't buy it because Holzim is a publicly known reference client of Obermott. And for quite a while, I uh, had problems because you because of insider trading, you mm -hmm. know, clauses. You have to make sure you buy the stock when there's a window for insiders to buy. Now, I don't know much about the company because they're just a client of ours. But still, I wanted to make sure I'm within that window where I can buy stocks. And right. this summer was such a window. So Holzin, I wanted to buy for a long time for several reasons. One, you see here, I put it on a, a watch list, Lafarge Holzin and CRH. I will tell you soon why. And you can see that Lafarge Holzin right now has a value rank of 79, a really good value. Um, the combined rank is 49, is despite the fact that they have a low safety and growth rank. Again, I'm not so worried about the growth rank because I'm investing in cement because I believe uh, here in the West, we will have to do a lot of um, repairing our infrastructure. And we have to build new infrastructure because climate change will demand it. And I think that companies like uh, Lafarge Holzim, Holzim uh, today, yes. by the way, changed their name again. It's not yet reflected here. I should probably change that too. Um, they changed it back to Holzim this summer. Uh, Holzim is in that construction business. And because uh, they're a client of ours, <laughs> I think uh, they do a really good job. Yeah. I think you also mentioned climate change. I just saw recently that they have some really interesting products when it comes to um, capturing, I think two that I heard about recently. One is sort of the self-repairing cement and the other one is cement that it absorbs uh, rainwater to try to help to bring it back into um, the, the ecosystem. So I thought, uh, I think from a climate change perspective, they do have some very innovative and very interesting products that they're developing. Yeah, I'm sure they, I'm sure they do. They have been... Um looking at sustainability for a long time. Even when I left uh, the university in 93 or 96, maybe after the dissertation, I had a friend who went there as the head of the sustainability department, Barbara Dubach. And she worked there for a long time and they, they did a lot in the sustainability area because it's a, it's a delicate business. Yeah. You know, cement uses a lot of uh, carbon and you have to find ways of making more, it more efficient. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I'm quite convinced there. And the reason why I also bought another company, CRH, uh, which actually looks quite similar when you look at the Obermott ranks. So it's, it's, I can't really comment on that much. It's really the same story than Holzim. I picked CRH because I had another uh, uh, user on one of the Obermott chats that we have uh, on, uh, in the mornings, weekly mornings, once, uh, once a week, we do this co uh, coffee schwatz, we call it, coffee talk. Coffee, coffee chat, yeah. Coffee chat. <laughs> Um, in, in the morning, sometimes in German, sometimes in English, and that, that, then it was in English. Uh, and the guy actually worked for CRH. <laughs> and he had this question, you know, should I buy more of the stocks? And then I asked him about Holzim, and he said, yeah, it's really interesting that CRH has a, has a, has a different product from, from Holzim. It's not really exactly the same cement, so they're a little bit on a different layer than Holzim is. And he found that more convincing than what Holzim does. And I didn't even go into the details because I had here the user that told me I'm buying CRH stock and he works for CRH. And I felt this was a really good reason to, to buy that stock as well. So when I bought Holzim, I bought CRH at the same time. Okay, interesting. So CRH and Holzim, this is, uh, these were my, you know, <laughs> old business <laughs> stocks that I bought this summer. And, uh, you know, if I complement them with your high technology stocks and your healthcare stocks, I think we have a good and well diversified portfolio. <laughs>